Cat messed with the plumbing. <laughs> he sure messed with you. <laughs> <laughs> Check out the sad-eyed kitty. Only a clueless alien would put up something this cheesy. Whoa! Oh, cat's been busy. Cat's been really busy. This must be the staging area for the invasion. <sighs> They're getting ready for liftoff. We're toast! Not if we destroy this place and everything in it before they get off the launch pad! Dennis! Take out his war room! Where's a mole map when you need one? Meeny, meeny, miny, mo! <laughs> Everyone, say hello to our new friend, Monsignor Monkey Spittle. He gets a little fussy at bedtime, but he's an excellent bridge player. <laughs> 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 Maybe three days in solitary will teach you to change Scooter's water more than once a week! <laughs> it's okay, Scootsy Wootsy. The big bad man can't hurt you while he's rotten in the can! A delinquent picking on a poor defenseless kitty cat? I'm coming, kitty! <laughs> Diamond, animal protection officer. <laughs> oh, is the little kitty all right? Don't worry, Buck is here. Everything's gonna be okay. <laughs> so, you think you're tough, do you, Buck? What have you done with this fur? A week in solitary ought to teach you to be nice to kitties. Huh? Wait! You can't lock my son up. How about letting him off with a warning? He's gonna be grounded anyway. Tough kibble. <laughs> Maybe I should call City Hall and find out if animal protection officers are actually allowed to arrest people. Hey, you got lucky this time, Funk. But I'm gonna be watching you like a hawk. <laughs> Next time I catch you hurting that cute little kitty, I'll lock you up and swallow the key. <laughs> That's how a real man handles a delinquent. <laughs> Inside, Coop. Your grounding starts now. Hey, wh where's my ball? <laughs> so, Cat wants to play hardball. Oh, haven't you just 
destroyed enough property for one day? Go to your room and consider yourself double grounded. Huh? Swoon and Eagle to Bashful Budgie! Swoon and Eagle to Bashful Budgie! Did you manage to take out Cat's war room? Dennis? Come in! <sighs> Time's running out! We gotta get back into those tunnels! There's a way in! Through the statue in the park! But it's kind of embarrassing. I saw Cat go in under Old Lady Munson's bird bath. No way! Her yard's a no kid zone! There's another secret hatch in the playground. We'll take that one. <laughs> That's it, Punk. You're going down, down, with a capital down! <laughs> Don't worry, Mr. Pussy Wussup. Buck's gonna make the rotten kid go away for a long time. Ah, Cat's here! And he's choking on something? Yeah, right. He's gotta be faking. But what if he isn't? If he croaks, we'll get blamed. And that crazy animal protection dude will lock us up forever. Try pushing on his stomach. Stat! Don't worry, Kitty. Buck promises those two are gonna get washed away by a cleansing rain of justice. That just leaves old lady Munson's birdbath! <laughs> Daddy, Coop's on TV! Tonight on a special episode of Bootsville's Most Wanted, huh? we're advising the public to keep an eye out for these two. Oh no! They're wanted for extreme kitty cruelty. <laughs> Seeing that delinquent get taken down. Get him back! And you don't have to bring Burton's burger back alive! You disobey me. Then I find out you're public enemy number one. Consider yourself triple grounded. Ah! 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 
This is one she can't pin on you, sport. First you wreck my lawn, then you commit novicide. When I get out of here, I'm gonna tear you and you Gotta go. See ya. <laughs> Bye. Hey. We've been looking for you, Diamond. Destruction of private property, numerous traffic violations, and you threw the mayor in jail for not changing the water in his turtle's bowl. Ah, oh, don't worry. His cases always get thrown out. Add littering to the charges. Think we should thank Buck for stopping the cat invasion? Nah. Oops! and threw her back out teaching her gnomes to tango. Oh! I'm here to take care of her for the week. That's awesome! What's the evil purple one up to this time? That gadget he's holding is a blackout device. Uh, don't worry about him, Fiona. I'm on it. Hey, quit hogging all the fun. I'm not hogging. I just don't want you to get hurt, that's all. That's all? You think I can't take care of myself? No, I mean, yes. I mean, you know, cat fighting's kind of dangerous. Fiona! It's time to trim my toenails! So, you want to go skateboarding later? Ooh, what if I break a nail? Sorry, Coop. I'm going to be too busy looking after my Auntie Munson all week. Uh... Tiara shopping. Wanna come? I want that one, Daddy. Yeah, actually, honey, I was hoping we'd find your new tiara at the discount store. Hey, who turned out the sun? It must be a sudden eclipse. Don't worry, Princess. Daddy's here. Oh, I hope you weren't scared, Mr. Cat. I don't get it, Dennis. Why is Fiona mad at me? Maybe she just wants you to get out of the way. Thieves have robbed the Fruitsville Jewelry Store and made off with a fortune in diamonds, just as a bizarre mini-eclipse hit the downtown area. Mini-eclipse? Sounds like Cat fixed his ring of darkness. There were no witnesses to the daring daytime jewelry heist, but the store's security camera caught this image of the shady suspects. <gasps> Millie. Daddy? If you recognize these sinister shapes, call Crookstoppers. This is Fiona's voicemail. You know what to do. 
Hey, Fiona. Hi. Um, we're going after Cat, and I thought maybe, you know, you, you'd want to come along if you're not too busy. Uh, but I guess you are, so... Hmm. Hello, Earth to Coop. Stolen diamonds? Fresh cat prints? Get your head in the game, will ya? My head's fine. Look, Bob Burns, he must have gone this way. Hmm. These tracks are real fresh. Keep your eyes peeled for a cat ambush. Fiona knew it was me calling. That's why she didn't pick up. Curse you, call display. I'm beginning to think saving the world and girls don't mix. Ah! Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. I'm just exercising. Uh, I'm Dennis. I haven't seen you around before. Are you new in town? I'm Estelle. I sit right behind you in science class. In fact, I've been sitting behind you in every class since first grade. Not that you'd ever notice. Oh, uh, well, I guess I'll see you in science class. If I turn around for some reason. I'm a bird watcher, too. Oh. These aren't binoculars. They're night vision goggles. You must be into owl watching. I'd love to spend the day with an advanced birder like you, Dennis. Oh, no. I'm not bird watching. I'm uh, tracking a vicious feral cat. Feral cats are a menace to birds. I'll help you drop it and take it to be spayed or neutered. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I thought you were cat. cat. <laughs> Fiona. Hi, Dennis. Who's your friend? I'm Estelle. I'm helping Dennis track down a vicious feral cat that's marauding through the woods eating helpless baby birds. Don't worry about that nasty cat, Estelle. I'm on its trail. No, I am. No, you're not. Yes, I am. No. Yes. No. Yes. No, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. I gotta find those diamonds and get them back, or Daddy will do hard time in the slammer. I've gotta return those stolen jewels so my baby girl won't end up in juvenile detention. Uh! Huh? <laughs> that one's big enough to keep the whole town in the dark. Could use their superior night vision to take over before anyone knows what's happening. I'm not gonna let that happen. Yeah! Is that mangy feral cat hiding in here? Whoa! Stay back! Nothing to see here. Why, Dennis? Isn't that the courtship display of the Uplands whooping crane? <laughs> Don't move! I have to find a light switch! Of course. Why do you think I left that voicemail asking you to come along? You did? 
Panty Munson confiscated my phone so it wouldn't wake her up from her nap. Uh-oh. Party crasher at 10 o'clock. <laughs> Remember how to do that nifty move? Yeah. After me, we can look after each other. I only said that stuff about not wanting you to get hurt because I, you know, like you. <laughs> well, I, you know, like you too. Fiona, will you help me sneak the diamonds back into the jewelry store? Yes, Coop, I will. What makes feeling better, Growler? I feel more days and I'll be right as. <gasps> Don't pin that heist on me, doll. Give up the stones, or it'll be no milk and cookies for life. Breaking news! The diamonds stolen from the Bootsville Jewelry Store have been anonymously returned. Now back to Private Eye Radio. All detective movie soundtracks all the time. Well, I'm happy the guilty party has seen the error of their ways. So am I, Daddy. Here, it's an old satellite that's been up there so long, everybody forgot all about it. Daddy! Oh, right. Permission slips. Going to the Empire City Science Center will be the most exciting school trip ever! I've never seen anything from outer space before. Careful what you wish for. <laughs> This is old lady, I mean, Mrs. Munson. She'll be your substitute torture, uh, teacher until Miss Brannigan returns from stress leave. One more outburst and... <laughs> and since you've already gone through the entire roster of available substitute teachers, I was left with only one last desperate, terrible choice. Lorne! Seriously, you don't want to mess with her! But my trusty Mr. Tooth Cushion is right here, dude! Crack oh. 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 window, Burton Burger! in the class! I need more trouble out of you and I'll give you a detention! Then you can kiss your precious field trip to Empire City goodbye! <laughs> Did you see that? Huh? You have no idea how giddy this makes me! <laughs> I need comfort food. Frozen yogurt! <laughs> Ms. Brannigan? Fancy meeting you here. You're looking very, um, 
Well, you, you look really stressed out. Is it that obvious? Whenever I'm feeling stressed out, I go fishing. Nothing beats a canoe for floating all your cares away. <laughs> that does sound nice. <laughs> uh -huh. Please tell me this is your project on the Dark Ages. It's what old Lady Munson calls old school discipline. Oh, what's next? Thumb screws? Know where I can buy some? Ah, come back here! How dare you parole my prisoner? Cat! <laughs> First old lady Munson, now get! What's the point of leaving home? Why would Cat follow you to school? It's not me he's following. He's going on a field trip? There's only one thing at Empire City Science Center he could be interested in. That down satellite. But why? Let's go ask him. <laughs> so, looks like you've been aiding and abetting a fugitive. Now you've all got detentions. <laughs> Don't whine to me about it. There's nobody to blame but Burton Burger. <laughs> Principal Dillegard? She gave me a detention for running in the halls. Bro, you got a detention too? No, I'm just hanging with you. <laughs> can't you do something about her? You're the principal. I can't stand up to old Lady Munson. I had her as a teacher when I was your age, and I still have nightmares. <laughs> Would you like a refill, Mrs. Munson? It's awfully dry in here. You think sucking up to me will get you out of here sooner? All right, Burton Burger, let's do this! You're still in detention, you little kiss-up. <sighs> it was worth a try. I have to step out for a second. Nobody speaks, nobody moves, while I'm in the little girl's room. Yeah! Okay, let's go on that field trip. Children, wait, please! Take me with you. Here you go. Are you kidding? She's really mellowed with age. Huh? No. Ouch! That wasn't so bad, was it? Oh. Okay, yeah, that, that was bad. But like I always say, it could be worse. For instance... We can clearly see in diagram 12A, the orbital anomaly is a mathematical certainty given the decaying trajectory of any given object. I'm sure you all recognize this equation for Newton's law of universal gravitation, which says the force is inversely proportional to the square. That's no 
Earth satellite. I know cat technology when I see it. Munson, you're fired for conduct unbecoming a substitute teacher. And that's saying a lot. <laughs> Nearly drowning, getting chased by a bear, falling off a cliff. Thank you so much. Uh, you're welcome. This has really helped put things into perspective. After today, teaching a bunch of rowdy kids will seem like a day at the spa. <laughs> It's good to be back. Coop, you've got a month of detentions for the Science Center catastrophe. You can start by writing, I will not break priceless space artifacts on the blackboard 10,000 times. <sighs> More time at school, less time at home with Cat and Old Lady Munson. That's not punishment, that's a reward. <laughs> do everything on your to-do list. You get to kick back and relax. Really? Thanks, sport. Whoa! I'm giving you an extra special present this year, Daddy. A Just Us Girls Daddy Daughter Spa Day! Sounds great, Sweet Pea. The relaxing was fun while it lasted. Huh, let's see. Take out the garbage, vacuum, mow the lawn, Oh man, clean the bathroom. I should have read this before volunteering. I got my dad for Father's Day was me, out of his way. He was thrilled. I figure it's the least I can do if I want Dad to cut me some slack the next time the shed blows up or the living room gets scorched thanks to... <gasps> Dad! Drop the weapon! <laughs> After I rinse off our ketchup and mayonnaise masks, we'll do a relish exfoliation. Coop, what's going on up there? He's still got your fingers and relax, Daddy! Sorry, Sugar Plum. Where'd that ray gun go? Uh -oh. 
Why is the hairless creep so interested in a toy rocket ship? It sure is detailed. Check out the laser turrets. Uh -huh. <laughs> Whoa! It's been mega sized! The rocket didn't get big. We got small! <laughs> 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 Mr. Pat, help me pick up nail polish for Daddy. Pink of really lime delicious. Ooh, passionate lad. Oh, purple posy with sparkles. <laughs> this lawn is out of control. No wonder Dad wants it cut. Incoming! Oh. Hey, cat boy, get out here! We need a collie, dude. Guess he's not home. <sighs> we have to get in trunk before it's all out. Don't make it quite so shopping! Check out this dress, girlfriend. <laughs> Please, spaghetti straps are so last Thursday. And is that avocado green? <laughs> I mean, what decade are we in? <laughs> Easy! <laughs> <laughs> I did promise Dad I'd take out the trash. What was that? <laughs> Sounded like the garbage can. Maybe Coop took it all the way to the dump. Laugh the new look, Burton Burger! This has gone straight into my Burton Burger's dumbest moment scrapbook! <laughs> 14 volumes so far! <sighs> Daddy, why are you taking off your makeup? Uh, don't be silly, Pumpkin. I wouldn't take off my Father's Day makeup for the whole world. Okay, the house is that way. <gasps> Look at that lawn. That grass must be over three inches high. I'll just give it a quick mow. I thought Coop said he would mow the lawn. Yeah, I'm on it, Dad. Hey, Dad! <laughs> Such a greasy complexion. Awesome makeup, Mr. B. Rock like it's 1970, dude. <laughs> okay, maybe that's enough mowing. At least in broad daylight. Back to spa day. Come on, Mr. Cat. You can help me paint Daddy's toenails. Wow. Huh? Looks like Cat's having a little flea trouble, Millie. <laughs> Don't worry, Mr. Cat. A flea bath will take care of that. I'll be right back to blow out your hair, Daddy. <laughs> Can't wait, Dumpling. Dust bunnies. I better get the vacuum. Oh man, he's doing the vacuuming too? I'm gonna look like a total slacker. We've got bigger problems, Coop. I don't want to stay half an inch tall. I'm already the smallest kid in gym class. But I promised Dad I'd come up! Cool! There you go, Mr. Cat. All better. Now I have to finish Daddy's do. <laughs> okay, time to get unshrunk. There he is. I sure hope that shrink ray works both ways. Right, no problem. Get the ray gun from a 12-story high alien. Oh. Why is it gonna zap his toy rocket? Huh? That's why it's so detailed. It's not a toy, Dennis. The thing's a real battleship. He's gonna unshrink it. And when he does, we'll get unshrunk with it. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
to work, remember? Oh, right. <laughs> Where are the flight controls? Try the joystick! I think I'm gonna like this. Not if I can help it. Tractor beam! I mean, tractor beam! Oh, this thing is equipped with way too many options. Hang on! Cat's gonna need a little motivation to fix this thing. You're gonna have to fix it now, cat! Okay, everybody line up. We'll make a bank shot off the mirror. Makeover. I have just the dress to go with it. Sorry about the shed. <sighs> oh well, accidents happen, especially around here. Thanks for taking out the garbage and uh, mowing the lawn. <laughs> this sure has been one memorable Father's Day. Coop, you seem taller. Well, I did have a growth spurt recently. Ugh. 